Steady hand. That's it. Watch it. Cast off line. Casting off. We're away. Please don't drown us. I just got back and I prefer not to die this close to home. Take us straight to Dunwall Tower. Lord Corvo has news for the Empress and we've come a long way. Now we have. A long way to bring bad news. The sailors say there's a curse on us. Black magic. It's not black magic. Superstition. For all we know, there's a cure for the plague by now. That'd be nice. Maybe. We live in strange times. Sending the Empress's bodyguard away for a couple of months. That's unusual. Well, this was important. We need help with the rat plague. Indeed. I can only kill so many rats before I get tired. I have to sleep too, you know. And those things made so fast, by the time I wake up, there's another hundred more to take their place. If there was another one of me, we could have had this solved in a few days. Ho oh, there! We're going up! Remember what I said about drowning us. If you kill us, I will kill you first before I go. Just say it. Home at last. Don't you tell me to relax, or I will relax you with a kick to the face. Tell me to relax. Steady pressure. And stop. Thank God. Shut her down. The Empress will be waiting for your news, Corvo. Best not keep her then. Hello, sir. Soldier. Corvo, you're back. Emily. Holy crap, you've gotten big. Will you tell me about your trip, please? Were there any whales? I can't right now. Wait! Let's play hide and seek first. I'll cover my eyes and you hide. Oh, Emily. Do you have time? Mother's busy talking to that nasty old spy master. Uh, I hate that guy. Alright, we can play one round. How about we go under the bridge and play? Okay, here we go. I'll meet you there in just a moment. Ooh. Crazy kid. Welcome home, Lord Protector. Overseer Campbell. Stop moving, Campbell. And you, Corvo, welcome back. Thanks. From wherever you've been. They sent him all around the Isles to beg for aid. Beg's a strong word. A waste of time. My elixir will banish the plague from this city. Now keep still a moment, High Overseer Campbell. Hopefully your elixir works. Except on Campbell. Sorry for the delay, Emily. I'm here. Let's see if you're still good at this. <laughs> I'll hide my eyes and count, and at the end of the countdown, I'll try and find you. Okay. Okay, I'm going to count to ten. Find a place to hide. Bring it on. Where are you? Good lord. If I was an actual assassin, this girl would have been dead like 19 times by now. I need to have her eyes and ears checked. Okay, you win. Yes. We should go now, so Mother can see you too. Ugh. Alright, let's go. Later, will you give me more climbing lessons? Sure. Someday I'm going to climb up to the rooftop. Let's start with a small tree, maybe. Well, when you fall, you don't, you know, die. Did you see any monsters while traveling to the other isles? My nanny says the big ocean's full of them. But I think she only says that to scare me. Nah, you don't need to worry about monsters in the ocean. I killed them all. They're sick people, not criminals. We've gone beyond that question, your majesty. They're- They're my citizens and we will save them from the plague if we can. All of them. Very well. We will not speak of this again. Told his ass. Mother, Corvo is back. Thank you, Emily. Leave us, please. As you wish, your majesty. I'd like to throw him and his creepy ass off the balcony. Spymaster. Corvo. Two days early. Full of surprises, as usual. I do what I can. Well, that was certainly ominous. Empress, I return. It's a fair wind that brings you home to me. What news have you brought? Follow me, Captain. Nothing good, sadly. I have a letter here you should probably read. To sum it up for you, we're out of luck, and we'll have to deal with this on our own. No one else is willing to send us help. I hope that one of the other cities had dealt with this before, knew of some cure. This news is very bad. We're at the breaking point. I'll start killing rats right away. Cowards. They're going to blockade us. They'll wait to see if the plague turns the city into a graveyard. Then invade. Are you okay, Mother? You seem sad. Yes, don't worry, darling. Mother is fine. Fine-ish. Wait, where are the guards? What? Who sent them away? Mother, look! What are they doing on the rooftop? Oh, crap. What? Emily, come here! You two, get behind me! 
Hi there! Nice of you all to drop no, in! Get behind me! Empress! Emily! We need to go! Look out! Oh, for the love... Another one! No. Try harder next time. They're gone. Are you two okay? <laughs> Corvo, thank you. If you hadn't been here... I know. What the... No, ah! Not again! Put me not down! No! Down! Get away from her! Leave her alone! Corvo! Empress! No! Uh, no! Uh, uh, Run, Emily! Get away! Emily! Corvo! Ah! Empress, please be alive. Corvo, it's all coming apart. It's gonna be okay. Find, find Emily. Protect her. I will. You're the only one who'll know what to do. Won't you? You have my word. Corvo. Empress. No. Oh, guards. Good. We need to move. What are you doing? Ward us all. Look at what he's done. What? Yes, he's killed the Empress. Seriously? Are you too daft? It wasn't me. I would never. What did you do with young Lady Emily, traitor? Nothing, I... Her own bodyguard. Ironic. I'll see you beheaded for this, Corvo. Peg him. Wait, I didn't do it. It wasn't me. It was... Uh... This is your final chance, Corvo. Uh, Sign the confession and let me give you the rights to put your spirit at ease. I don't confess to shit. Wait, no! Ah! 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 That's enough for ah. now. Get out. Ah. Let's ah. give the man some time ah. to think. Oh, I'm thinking of something. Come closer and I'll show you. Corvo, ah. the Empress is dead. Her daughter Emily is hidden away, and no one will ever know the truth. I'll know. Yes, unlucky you. And you. Tomorrow you'll be executed. But it's for a good cause. This country needs strong leadership now. Someone to guide the weak. And that's where we come in. Can't help if you're dead. There was nothing personal in this. Even though you almost sank our plans. But it turned out well. You were in the wrong place at the right time. And someone has to take the fall. And you think it'll be me? Goodbye, Corvo. Oh, this isn't goodbye! Because you're gonna see my blade at least yourself. one more time! As it slides across your throat! <sighs> hmm? Who's there? You should eat, Corvo. This meal comes from a friend. Oh, I was unaware I had any friends. The only ones I had decided to execute me. Red? Oh, a note. Gorvo, who we are is irrelevant right now. Just know that we have faith in you. Here's the key to your cell. Once you're out, head for the prison's interrogation room. Take the explosive there and plant it on the outer door. When the bomb goes off, run. Make for the river and lose yourself in the sewers. You'll find some useful gear stashed there. One of the prison guards will leave a weapon just outside your cell, and good luck. We need you alive and well for what's to come, a friend. Well, isn't that nice? Best gift I've ever gotten. Come around. Hey, it's good. Smell you from here, please, not now. Oh yeah. Now let's get out of here. Hmm, I need a distraction. Attention. That'll do. Solitary wing is Sorry, buddy. Sometimes there's orders you just shouldn't follow. Like locking me up. Because now I'm going to make everyone pay. Oh, this place looks familiar. If I see Campbell or that stupid spymaster, I'm ripping off their faces. Did they record my interrogation? Corvo's unconscious again. Though he's taken more punishment than in two men we brought in for interrogation. Damn straight. When he wakes, we'll start again. Having him sign the confession for her murder isn't critical, but it might be useful to us later. The assassination of an empress is not a trivial matter. Well, I never did, so it sucks to be them. There they are. Let's go make a really big exit. Hmm, two. Gotta play this smart. Did I 
Tell you about the time I almost caught that guy who killed the Empress. Blow off. You most certainly did not. Uh, they hurt me. Surprise, boys! <sighs> Definitely not as clean as I wanted, but can't argue with results. Ooh, big door. Better knock real loud. Knock, knock. Ugh. Whoa! Time to go! Oh, damn it. Oh, damn it! Hey, fellas! Just passing through! <sighs> I can lose them in here. Should be minimal guard presence down here. How many people did he kill on his way out of the prison? A lot. I guess if you'll kill the Empress, you don't care about a few guards. Shut up! Look at this stuff. Somebody's been down here. Bottle Street gang, maybe. Watch for booby traps. Could be some down here by the look of it. Good. If we're lucky, one of them will get... Oh. Oh. That's not right. Oh. Rats are getting a bit more aggressive. We're gonna have to solve this plague. Oh, that's gross. Ho ho ho! The loyalists came through. Oh, I missed you, old friends. Let's go kill us some traitors and find Emily. Lady Emily, heir to Corvo, the over here. Yes? Quickly. I'm Samuel. Corvo. And I work for some good people who want very much to meet you. They said you'd come out here. I can still hardly believe it. I'll take you to meet them. Just down the river from here. Sounds great. I'd like to meet them too. Let's go. So where are we exactly? This is the Hound Pits pub. Closed for business. Half the district marked off is dead from the plague. Damn. We're right under the Lord Regent's nose and he don't know a thing. Good, I'd like to keep it that way. Until I shove my sword in his eye. Of course, if anyone finds out what we're up to, the watch will break in with swords drawn. And now that you've escaped, the Lord Regent's going to be tearing the city apart. He's gonna need to send them all if he wants to bring me back in. Take you up to meet Admiral Havelock and the rest of the loyalists. The Admiral's a man to be reckoned with. If anyone can help you find that missing girl, Lady Emily, and clear your name, he can. Let's get to it then. There's no time to waste. I have a girl to save. We can continue this later, Lord Pendleton. The man of the hour is here. Gentlemen. Corvo, I'm Admiral Havelock. A true servant of the Empire, like you. Good until the Lord Regent purged those of us who wouldn't recognize his claim on the throne. And I'm Lord Trevor Pendleton. I represent the nobility in our little group. But we all act as equals here at the Hound Pits pub. This is a momentous occasion, Corvo. Is it? I'm going to come out with it. We've been building a coalition of loyalists, aimed at ending the Lord Regent's tyranny and restoring the throne. At risk of execution, we're committed to finding young Lady Emily and seeing her crowned as Empress. I'm in. We've got big plans. But we can't do any of it without you. We need your skills, your ability in a fight. And in helping us, we're going to help you destroy the men who murdered the Empress. Yes. Sorry. You must be exhausted. We can discuss this further after you've recovered. But before you retire, you should introduce yourself to Piero. He's challenging at times. But his industrious mind buys him that right. I'll make sure to speak with him. Yes. Piero's as much an artist as a technician. He's going to be crafting the gear you'll need. Go talk to him, and then get some sleep. We can talk more when you've rested. I have my sword, that's all I need. Hmm. Can I have this? Good to have you with us, Corvo. That's a no. Nothing against the others, but there's no substitute for a man who's done his service for the crown. Well, I'm about to spill a lot of blood for the crown. I'm gonna go talk with this guy, and then we save Emily. Hello there, I was told to meet with you. I'll be crafting your weapons and gear. All custom work. For you, I will create the tools of a master assassin. Oh, you and I are gonna get along nicely. What happened? No! This cannot happen now. The tank of whale oil's running. That bad? Will you get a new tank from upstairs, please, while I hold this in place? Be careful. Oil's unstable. Oh? When it explodes, there's a terrible mess. I can imagine. Be right back. 
There you go. Perfect. Thank you, Cole. No problem. Here, see? The assassin's mask. Ooh. You're a wanted man, so everyone in the city knows your face. But this mask will mean terror to them. If you just hold still, the fit must be precise. There. Oh. Can you see normally? Nope. Center lens out of alignment. Seems that way. There. Better now? No. I could create more for you. Upgrades for your gear, weapons, munitions. But our situation here is desperate. Scavenge the city for oh, valuables, that's better. and I will resell them on the black market. That should give us the money to craft the things you need. I can do that. Time for sleep. <sighs> uh, feels like I just went to sleep. Uh, oh well. Let's get to work. Whoa, that's not right. What the heck did I eat? Eh, might as well roll with it. No telling what kind of dream this is. Ah! Hello, Corvo. Greetings. Your life has taken a turn, has it not? Oh yeah. The Empress is dead. Her precious daughter Emily is lost somewhere in the city. Rub it in. And you will play a pivotal role in the days to come. For this, I have chosen you and drawn you into the void. And who are you exactly? I am the outsider, and this is my mark. What? There are forces in the world and beyond the world. Great forces that we call magic. And now, these forces will serve your will. Use this newfound power, my gift to you. And what do you want in return? Come find me. All right. Ominous. So how does this work? Oh, ho, 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 ho. oh that is going to be useful. Whee! <laughs> In the days that follow, your trials will be great, Corvo. Yeah, I can handle it. Seek the ancient runes bearing my mark in the lonely places of your world and at shrines raised in my name. Why? These runes will grant you powers beyond those of other men. Ooh. To help you find these runes, I give you this. The heart of a living thing Ew. molded by my hands. Not gonna lie, that's creepy. With this heart, you will hear many secrets, and it will guide you toward my runes, no matter how they may be hidden. Well, that's useful. Listen to the heart now, and find another rune. This is different. Not used to listening to hearts. More used to stopping them. Ew, 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 ew. Come here, Rune. Huh. So is this what he was talking about? Interesting. How you use what I have given you falls upon you, as it has to the others before you. Others before me? And now I return you to your world. But know that I will be watching with great interest. Not creepy at all. Uh, oh, what a weird dream. Ah, not a dream. What the hell is going on? Uh, it doesn't matter. As long as it helps me save Emily and avenge the Empress, I'll take whatever help whatever deity wants to give me. Gah, the heart's real. Oh, I'd hoped I dreamed that. Oh, ah, uh, ah. Uh.